Yo guys, what is up? It is Nick, and today they release new all 25 cards along with the solo challenge and a little news about what is coming up. So, first of all, you played this solo challenge day one combine challenge. It is for the Patrick Peterson, the new card that was released, and then you get a uh, pack, a combine pack, which I'm going to open up. Uh, what I think all you can pull is the collectible one collectible out of it and so you want to look for the gold ones and you especially want speed that one's worth the most I believe oh gold and acceleration not bad have no idea how much that's going for but at least I got a gold one I'm not sure if you're guaranteed a gold one uh, but I'm happy I got a gold one um, let me go check and see in his collection if the gold one is there the acceleration Yes, okay, that's good. You want, I think there's a couple of silvers and golds that aren't in uh, uh, in their collections uh, because they have their specific three. I think there's specific three for each player with Patrick Peterson, it's Man, Illusiveness, and Play Rec. And then I think there's just the base speed, acceleration, awareness, and there's a couple other ones. Uh, but it's nice that I pulled that. Hopefully it's worth some. I'll go check that price out. And throw it up. Um, I'm going to make a video kind of explaining how to save time and stuff like that. And how to make coins and all that different junk. Uh, not really kind of the... It's going to be kind of super basic and super advanced. All clustered into one uh, video. I don't know. It's going to be weird. It's going to be like a cluster together of different things. Uh, where is acceleration? Please be worth. Okay. Okay, this is looking good. This is looking good. 60, really? 64,000? <laughs> okay, I'll take it. Oh, the, the, the luck is unreal. The luck is unreal. I'll put it up for 59. The luck is unreal. Um, I'm going to put it up for, I'm not going to put it up for the full time. I think I'll put it up, let's see here, eight hours. Because I will still be awake then. Uh, so the new legendary cards. Uh, I couldn't find one of them on the auction, so I'm just going to have to show you his collection. But this one was released in the packs. You, there is no collection for him. And that is my boy Ed Reed, 99 overall, all man 25 free safety, man defense, and pass rush. Pretty good stats, really good, well, actually really good stats. I'll throw them up in comparison to, uh, I'll do uh, Devin McCourty first. Uh, he's got five better awareness, um, one better zone, two better press, and four better play rec. But if you think about it, Devin McCourty actually has two better zone because of his boost. Or one better zone because of his boost. And then let's take a look at Sean Taylor. He's got one better agility, five better awareness, three better man, two better zone, seven better, or no, wait, seven, no, 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 and six better play rec. So, I don't know, he could fit on my team. Uh, he really could. I'm thinking about, um, if somebody can tell me in the comments... Uh, if that plus two to zone that Devin McCourty gives, if I still get it, if I play him out of position, let me know because I know like the the chemistry doesn't work and all that jazz. So I'm just wondering if maybe the boost doesn't apply. I don't know. It probably still does. You just have to have him on the field. And the legendary Derek Thomas zone defense and run stuff. I couldn't find one on the auction. Um, so yeah, I'm just gonna have to show you this way. He's got eight collectibles, and I'm guessing at the moment there's probably one collectible that's not up. That's how it was going, uh, when Isaac Bruce was first released, and Orlando Pace, uh, and Charles Woodson, there was all, and Sean Taylor, there was only, there was always only one, uh, there was always one collectible that wasn't up, so it took till Sunday, for you to be able to see it, I'll look again. I think I'll just, I'll just search legendary chiefs. And if that doesn't work, no, 
There's all his collectibles. We will go... Let's see here, we'll go legendary linebackers. Okay, he's not up. Sometimes they jack up, so I'll check D-line. Actually, they jack up a lot. Okay, good, they actually didn't screw this one up completely. Uh, but yeah, but he's not up. So, just take a look. Did my thing already sell? No, Monte Davis sold. Okay. Uh, so, I actually am selling off my corners because that Pat Pete has actually dropped in price. So, I'm just going to go after him. Uh, also, those legendary cards that... Uh, the... Uh, what am I trying to say? The... The legendary collections. They're going to be coming out of... The, uh, oh my gosh, I can't think. They're going to be coming out of collections. You're not going to be able to get them anymore or do them anymore. They're also taking out the solo challenges. So all the ones that are, I think all of them, maybe not Derek Thomas, Isaac Bruce, maybe not up to, maybe, maybe just these three will stay. Hopefully Sean Taylor gets taken out because then my Sean Taylor will go up in value. But I would buy up all... The ones back here if you can if you can get them for cheap i'd buy them up not the elites supposedly the elites are staying in so just get like um as many legendaries as you can get i wouldn't say like kurt warner and stuff like that but especially the offensive linemen brian dawkins uh shannon sharp dion um even these back here like lawrence taylor and just some of the one, the more, uh, not simple ones, but more of the desired. Ronnie Lott, Rod Woodson. Just all the different ones that are back here. Dick Lane, just in case, uh, and uh, maybe get their collectible. I don't know. Just make sure to try to pick up some of the legendary cards that go in the collections. Like Randall, I think the biggest ones are Sean Taylor, Randall Cunningham. Randy Moss, definitely Randy Moss, all the linemen, because linemen are already expensive, so just try to get all the linemen, Ryan Dawkins, Shannon Sharp, I think that's about it, maybe Dion, but there's the other Dion, but those are the big ones I'd make sure and try to get, uh, just to uh, not save coins, but make sure and not, uh, not I don't know, make coins. If you want to make coins, there we go. That's the words I was looking for. If you want to make coins, go ahead and do those. Supposedly, they're also taking out the legendary solo challenges. So all the ones, like, the gr greatest of all time, play that one and get the Jerry Rice collection, uh, 1,000 coins. The Deacon Jones Secretary of Defense, you can play that, get a 1,000, and the collectible. Same with the Reggie White. I think they also collect for something, too. So you can get Steve Young, Dave Casper, Ronnie Lott, Fred Blitchnikov, Jack Ham, Rod Woodson, Mean Joe Green, Troy Aikman, Otto Graham, Gene Upshaw, Emmett, Dan Marino, Michael Irvin, Dan Deardorff, Dick Lane, John Randall, Sammy Boss, Steve Largent, John Mackey, and George Blanda. So if you want to actually get any of these cards maybe after they remove these solo challenges, I would play them now. Because I think it was on 360, they had they removed all of these. They removed a bunch, and you couldn't get them anymore. Um, maybe maybe I'm wrong. Maybe I'm thinking of something else. But you couldn't get them. I don't know if they're going to be removing. Maybe they put these in the elites so that they wouldn't remove them. But somehow I think that's wrong. I don't know. We'll just have to wait and see next weekend what they are going to do. But that's going to do it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. Drop a like if you did. Subscribe if you haven't. And I will catch you guys in my next video. Peace out, guys.